So we have just passed Moshoro, which is a little village just outside of Sarui. And this is where we're starting our gravel tour for, well, the next two days. And then we'll hit a little bit of tar, about 50 kilometers, and then another full day of, of gravel going back. So yeah, we've just uh, parked off here, make some coffee. I'm going to deflate the wheels now, and then we are off. So yeah, this is the road towards the cut line and we will be going to Sour Pants. We will be visiting Kukunya Island. See if we can make it to Kukunya Island, which would be great. So yeah, enjoy the, enjoy the episode guys. Let's see, let's hope. I hope this is gonna be a good one. Maybe a little bit of adventure. I see this this uh, gravel road here, it's, it's been used frequently. So this is not, anything hectic down here but we'll see when we get to the to the cut lines on the way to to Kukunya Island Okay, so we have reached the start of the Kukunya Island. So that's the island there at the back. And uh, this is the last stretch. We need to take to the island. So, um, yeah, this, this could be an easy six kilometers or it could be an easy six hours of getting stuck. Uh, we're not sure. There was nobody at the vet fence that we were now. I, I walked around there looking for somebody. There was nobody there. So I've got no sense of idea what the road is going to look like now and if it's possible or not. But uh, yeah, we're going to try it out now. We're going to try. We're going to see how far we can go. And let's let's hope we can make it. Really would like to sleep on the island tonight. So this is what's called the, the ancient pebble beach. So um, yeah, there's some close-ups of the of the little pebbles I'll show you guys and yeah there we are there's Donne busy showing you guys the close-ups of the of the pebbles so let's see let's hope we can do this let's hope we can make it it's the final stretch see you guys that side
Okay, so we have reached the infamous Kukunya Island. There it is. Sour pans. Absolutely awesome spot. And yeah, we made it quite easily. It's quite dry, so normal, no problems, no issues. And yeah, it was lovely the drive here, and we've got an awesome, awesome little spot for the for the camp tonight. We're busy making some food. Made the kids some pizzas and we're gonna make some dessert as well in the wild dog pizza oven and we're busy just uh, with some meat on the fire but what an awesome spot eh? amazing really 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 happy to be out again and being able to to spend our days outdoors so yeah have a look at our campsite really really cool so yeah tomorrow we head off to Nata and we'll see if we can check out the Nata bird sanctuary for a sundowner
so yeah we're on the cut line again on our way to Kama Rhino Sanctuary we had a incredible night at Iselby um, Iselby River Camp in Nata thanks to Rupert and Sylvia for hosting us awesome place you guys can go check it out uh, we had an amazing experience actually last night we went to to Elephant Sands for a sunset to go see some elephants along the the waterhole and we managed to see zero elephants at the waterhole but on our way back uh, to Iselby camp we got a few elephants as well as four cheetahs about five kilometers from Elephant Sands gate on the main road on the Kasani road we found four cheetahs Oh, we weren't quick enough to capture it on camera. I tried, um, but yeah, we couldn't. We couldn't capture it. I even followed them into the bush, but yeah, they were just gone again. So, amazing experience. Really, really great experience. And I'm sure we're gonna have an awesome time at Kama Rhino Sanctuary now as well. So we just parked off here now. It's just around two o'clock now, and we're just gonna make some awesome cheese and bacon sausage put it on a roll and just enjoy it while we eat the road again we're driving cut line again until uh, Mashoro village and from there we on the tar road to Kama Rhino so we'll probably see you guys at Kama Rhino again thanks for watching so far it's been an incredible long weekend for us as a family to get out again after this whole COVID thing and being stuck at home and sorting out all of all of our lives and the lives around us but we are happily to be back in the bush and growing my own little bush now so yeah enjoy guys thanks for watching Okay, so that marks the end of uh, another awesome trip here in Botswana. 
and uh, on our way home now around 200 and something kilometers still to go just parked off a little bit stretch some legs so thank you guys thanks for watching and thanks for a thousand subscribers on the channel we really appreciate it and it motivates us to to go out and make more videos like this so thanks a lot and we'll see you on the next one cheers